What is up guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to make a Bitwall server in Alternose. So if you don't know, Alternose is a server making company where you can make servers for free. So let's get right into this video. So as you can see, I've come to my website, alternose.org. So just go to that link and it will bring you to in this page just put play and go to your server and uh, just go to your software and install spigot so i will put 1.8.8 so i'll just put install yes so i'm installing spigot and now go to the plugin section and type in Bed Wars. Oops. Okay. Bed Wars Row. So after doing that, uh, click on this plugin right here and install it. So this this only works for versions 1.8, 1.9, 1.10, 1.11, and 1.12. So just keep that in mind. You can't do 1.16 or any other version beyond that. So, next, you will need to go to players and uh, you will need to make yourself OP. So, I'll just make myself OP right here. And as you can see, I'm, an, I'm OP right now. So, the next thing which you need to do, go to your world section and put any Bedwars map you want into the world, world section. So, I will put my Ashore map. So I'll link it down in the description. You can even download it for yourself. So as you can see, our world is loaded now. So the next thing what you need to do is go to options and go and customize your options. So I will put cracked on survival, survival on and uh, difficulty. I would recommend peaceful. So PvP on, fly on or off, you can do whatever you want. Uh, village is on, monster off, uh, animals off, nether off, achievements off. And I think that's about it. Go ahead and uh, start your server. So I'll be there when I finish starting my server. Okay, bye till then. So, as you can see, we have come to our world, our Usher map, as you can see. So, uh, before we get into this video, I just want to mention that there will be no diamonds uh, or emeralds in this uh, server. So, just I'm just reminding you that. And there will be bronze, iron and gold. So, those will be the generator. So yeah, uh, so let's get right into this video. So as you can see, we have come to our uh, world. So I'm just gonna get creative and go right here. So what you need to do is go put slash bw and uh, add game any map. So I'll put ashore uh, two. So as you can see, our new game show has been successfully added. So just go down over here, just down below all of these maps, right here. Okay, I think this is a good place. So just do slash bw set region uh, assure lock one. So I think, yeah, so our location one has been successfully added. So now we just need to go here above all of these, but below the, uh, the lobby. So just go that. I think that is a good place. So I'll just do slash VW set region. Oh, set region. Lock two. Oh no, slash BW set region assure 
Log 2. So as you can see, our location 2 has been successfully added. So now we need to add the teams. So I'll just do slash BW, add team, assure blue, and the color will be blue. Oh, I forgot to put a 2 there. So add, add team, assure blue, blue, 2. I'll just copy this. So our blue team has been successfully added. So now we'll just add red team. So I'll just do red, red, 2. So that has been successfully added. Uh, and, uh, and you can even create more teams as well, as you can see yellow and green. Uh, so for this video, I'll be only doing red and blue. So this will be blue team. I'll just go right here. And now what you need to do is you need to set the spawn location for the team. So I'll just, I'll just put like right here. I'll just face in that direction. And I will do slash PW set spawn assure blue. As you can see, the team blue spawn location has been added. So let's go to the red team and add their spawn location. So let's go there. So we have come to the red base. So our spawn location will be here. And slash PW set oh set spawn assure red so spawn location red has been added now we need to set their bed so i'll just point over here and i will do slash bw set bed red no slash set bed assure red okay now We'll go to the blue team, as you can see. So point to the bed and do slash BW, set bed, assure, blue. So as you can see, our respawn block of team blue has been added. So now you need to set the spawners. So this is a tricky part. So for this, as you can see in a normal Ashore map, you can see that iron and gold comes from the same place. So I'll just break these blocks here and I'll put a soul sand. Soul sand as our bronze, iron block as our iron generator. Oh, I just, okay, and gold block as our gold generator. So this will be a bronze. I'll just break that block as well. No, that'll be gold and this will be iron. So I'll just place slabs there. And yeah, so we'll set the spawn of bronze first. So we'll just do slash BW set spawner assure bronze. So I'll just do that and let's go to the iron. So fresh BW set spawn on sure iron. And then just change it. Now put gold. And then just do the same for the red team. So let's go to the red base and add our spawner. So I'll just break all of these blocks. So, oh, I always forget that. I don't know why. Okay, whatever. So we'll just put our slabs there and we have our generator. Put the bronze. Then we have our iron. Then we have our gold. Gold. Okay, so we have set our spawner. Now what you need to do is item shop. So since there are no diamonds, there will be only item shop. So what you need to do is I'll just give myself a barrier. 
barrier block. So I'll just put two over there and I'll just take a villager spawn egg and place it right there and just right click it and leave. Yes, that's it's that simple. So just go here, go to the blue team and add your villager. And just right click. Okay, so that so that's done. We need to go to our lobby. We need to set our lobby now. So just go here, and uh, I'll put it right here. So I'll take two armor stands. So I'll put two there. As I have red and blue team. So if you have green and yellow, you can even put like that. So I only have red and green, I mean red and blue. So I'll just put those two armor stands. So now what you need to do is go to the middle of this lobby, which is this block, and do slash pw set lobby ashore. So as you can see, our lobby was su successfully. Now we need to put main lobby, which we need to put slash bw set main lobby assure. So our main lobby was done. Now we need to make the teams. So slash bw add team join assure blue. So what you need to do is right click on the block or armor stand which you want. So I'll put my blue team there, slash VW, set, I mean add team join red. Oh, I forgot the map. So yeah, add team join red. Oh, I, I can't did it. Wow. So just do slash bw at team join assure red. So just right click it that. So there you go. We have your teams. Now what you need to do is save this game. So slash bw save assure. Okay, so it is successfully added and saved. So what you need to do is take a sign right here and place a sign there now what you need to do is draw, uh, type in uh, square brackets bw and square bracket close enter assure then just put done and you can see it has stopped so to just start the game you just need to put slash bw start assure so after doing that, you can just right click this and you can enter your game. So just click the bed and choose any team you want. So I'll just put red team and then just click the diamond to start the game. So I have started the game right here. As you can see, our game has been added. And as you can see, our generator right here is spawning bronze, gold, and iron so bronze and bronze will come more faster because bronze is the you know what I'm saying okay so as you can see our blocks is here so smooth sandstone is the thing which you need to bridge with so as you can see I'll go to middle if I if I fail my speed bridge oh my god going to be hilarious. Oh, that's, that was the right blocks. Wow, 40 blocks. So I can just take other items and buy it from my shopkeeper. You know, you need bread, pork chop, then Works, armor. Armor is very cheap, 
So you can just buy leather armor and some sword. One nine. Wow, that is that is so good. That's why you don't need any diamond upgrades. So I think that is it for this video. I can just jump into the void and then win the game. Yay, I won! Look! Yes, now I'll be back to the lobby in 5 seconds. Okay, there you go. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. This took a long time to make. So, uh, by the way, this is one take. Oh my god. I mean, whatever. This took a long time to make. And please subscribe and like the video. Please. Please.